Uh, uh, vCloud Director is a two-sided cloud provisioning and cloud management platform. Uh, it is available to all of VMware's cloud provider partners. Uh, VMware cloud provider partners use vCloud Director to provision infrastructure and cloud services for enterprises to consume. And vCloud Director also has a, has a tenant-facing side where enterprises consume cloud resources and cloud services such as, such as disaster recovery, backup, data protection through vCloud Director from a cloud provider partner. So some of the benefits of uh, vCloud Director for, v, uh, for enterprises is the self-service ability of a easy to use common interface for them to construct and manage all the lifecycle operations of a virtual machine or a virtual uh, application inside of a cloud service portal on that. Some of the new benefits of VCD95 is a very easy to use H5 interface built on our Clarity framework that you see across all of our VMware products uh, across the board on that. Moreover, our focus is providing this multi-site and multi-cloud federation concept using vCloud Director. This current release that we announced at, at VMworld 2018 is vCloud Director 9.5, and it has it has a bunch of new improvements, primarily uh, powered by deeper integration with other products. So, for example, we have uh, stretched L2 networking powered by deeper integration with NSX. We have initial integration with NSXT. Uh, we have a completely redesigned uh, role-based access control system, which makes it very easy for operations both on the cloud provider side and the tenant side. the significant uptick in usage across a lot of our cloud providers. Uh, not just from virtual machine utilization, but now also cloud native applications and accessing Kubernetes through a vCloud Director instance and you know, providing our service providers with the ability to construct these value added services in a common platform using vCloud Director as that platform to manage all that. We realize that uh, more and more cloud decisions are driven by the developer and the DevOps community and enterprises. It's not just cloud admins anymore. So uh, vCloud Director has exposed itself through a REST API. We have programmatic interfaces such as a Python SDK, a VCD CLI, uh, and you can provision VCD as code through Terraform, through Ansible, and there's a lot of good work that's going on with uh, extending uh, VCD through VRO plugins. vCloud Director's uh, HTML5 user interface has, has a bunch of new improvements. Uh, for example, we have a multi-site ribbon. Uh, we have, uh, right from the UI, you, you have full access to uh, network governance, to role governance, to control. Uh, and best of all, uh, vCloud Director's UI is extensible. So we have an Angular framework that we expose to, uh, to any third party that wants to natively integrate their services onto VCD. So vCloud Director uh, is a cloud provisioning platform that is multi-tenanted. So um, a cloud provider can essentially have a pool of SDDC resources, software-defined data center resources, so vSphere, vSAN, NSX, and additional products such as you know, vROPS for cloud management and cloud visibility. common platform that can be deployed very quickly and even using new technologies like Cloud Provider Pod that can instantiate the entire platform in a matter of hours now.